What is going on Java Minecraft players that want to play with Sodium with Amethyst Launcher? Today we're going to talk about this little message that pops up on your screen now. Yeah, it sucks, doesn't it? Sodium detected. It appears you're using Sodium. This is unsupported and may lead to graphical issues or crashes. Please remove it in all dependent mods. Which is absolute nonsense. Well, not really. Sort of. It depends on your device, okay? I'm telling you this because I gave you guys a guide. I also gave you guys a mod pack called OptiMobile, which is a mobile mod pack ready to go that has been proven to give you more FPS and stable FPS that has sodium in it. Now, if you don't know, Amethyst used to be the old developers of Pojav Launcher. Pojav Launcher is now dead. And Pojav Launcher and the developers of sodium hate each other. That's all I'm gonna tell you about, okay? They don't like each other. I don't think they hate each other, but I don't think they like each other. Mostly because kids used to go into the sodium Discord and they used to talk about Pojab Launcher and saying, oh, Sodium's not working. And usually it was the case of brain rot content creators that shared false information and didn't show them how to set up Sodium properly. That's all I'm gonna say. I remember this because this was like a couple years ago too. And this was back when Pojab Launcher started getting Sodium support and everything. So yeah, it's because of that partially and basically the Amethyst team and Sodium developers kind of agreed that, hey, we won't really do too much around Sodium, we won't support it. I even say in my video, do not ask for help in the Amethyst Discord, they will not help you. I also say in my videos, hit that subscribe button if you like this kind of content, if you like to watch my videos about how to set up mods, mod packs, Amethyst Launcher, Java Minecraft on your Android and so on and so forth. And check out my playlist because I have an entire playlist for Amethyst Launcher that you should check out if you want to learn things that you probably didn't even know. Now, why am I in here? This is the settings tab. I am showing you a setting that they ended up adding in experimental stuff called run sodium forcefully. At the bottom of the screen, this is with the latest nightly build, which is linked in the description of every video, by the way, that is around Amethyst Launcher at least. You need to click this button right here and then you need to answer this question, which is 5-7. Not 6-7, they didn't do anything stupid like that, it's 5-7. I really hate 6-7, it's the most annoying thing in the world. So you have to answer this, wait for that OK button to appear, which it has a countdown timer, and then press OK. Obviously, if you don't know how to do math, then maybe you should use a calculator and that's basically it. Now that that countdown timer is done, press OK. Oh, I failed the math test. What was the question? I swore it was five, seven. Nine multiplied by, oh, they change it every time by four plus five. So 36 plus five, 41 minus two is 39. Okay, well that's stupid. They change it. I guess they change it every time. So let's just wait and Wait for the countdown again. So also before you hit that okay button, make sure you take note of the sodium is unsupported. You are on your own. No support will be given in the Discord server. Using sodium may result in bugs, glitches, and crashes. No help will be given, even if you lose any of your worlds or saves. Now what's one multiplied by five? The, this math equation changes every time. And there we go. At least the math is right. Maybe they trick you sometimes like they do with me. And then if you use my mod pack, OptiMobile, which has another mod called Podium, which also circumvents the sodium mod to actually work, then you'll be able to use sodium and you'll be able to just enjoy the features that sodium has for you with it inside of the mod packs that actually have sodium. So like NeoForge has sodium. There's some mod packs on the mod pack section, like Fabulously Optimized that has sodium and so on and so forth. But as you can see here, Sodium works. And I personally, with my devices, I've never experienced any issues with Sodium. Now, some devices, no matter what your device is, a little bit of a tip here too at the end of this video, your device matters a lot to be performant by itself without even the use of Sodium. And what I mean by that is that even if you have like a really lower end spec device and a potato device or whatever you want to call it, no matter what you do, you're probably not going to get 60 plus FPS even if you use sodium. Sodium isn't going to fix that, especially if your device isn't really a gaming phone or a gaming handheld like mine is that I'm using in this video. This device is a AYN Odin 2. It's a gaming handheld that has different performance modes and uh, active cooling and everything like that to keep the chipset from thermal throttling and everything. But all I'm saying is that I have a video that I tell you 
Sodium by itself is not going to just fix your device. And the thing about sodium is that it helps with the actual renderer system that vanilla Minecraft has and makes it a little bit faster. It shows a lot more of a difference on a lot of PCs, but on mobile, I've only noticed like a hundred plus FPS difference, which only is a lot. Like that's a lot of difference in, in uh, actual retrospect, but it's just the fact that it's not going to fix a potato device. And a lot of kids, on TikTok, for example, like people use TikTok a lot for learning things. And I don't understand why, because you're watching a 30 to 60 second video about how to do something and it's not really teaching you much of anything. Now, I guess you can do like three minute videos, but do kids actually watch three minute videos on there? I don't know. And I always say kids because I just imagine kid brain rot six, seven nonsense that they go on there and they're like, oh, I found it on TikTok. And I'm like, yeah, then that's why it doesn't work usually half the time. But anyway, so here you go. This is the fix for sodium with Amethyst Launcher. So basically just go to that setting, go to experimental settings. And if you don't see that, that means that you didn't listen to my video and you had TikTok brain rot. Yeah, because you didn't pay attention and you basically didn't listen to the fact that I said this is the latest version of Amethyst as of today, which is December 30th, no, December 29th, 2025. It's almost New Year's, it's almost 2026. See you in 2026 probably, or maybe not. I'll probably have more videos before then. Have a nice day, love you all, and as always, bye-bye.